What's the business driver for looking at much larger sites? There's three things really. We believe as a team that's our niche. So, I mean, if you look at the FIDRA and the team that we've got, we're all from large scale, generally gas backgrounds. You know, we've operated, we've built and optimised large power stations. Um, so we think that's our niche. That's what we're good at. The second thing is we believe that grid needs it. In order to meet their ambitions, we think they need large scale storage. And there hasn't been very much large scale built to date. And we think they need that to get over that next hurdle to the targets that they want to achieve. So we believe that grid need it to create that, that um, clean grid. I guess. Yeah, yeah. And then the last thing is, it's cheaper to build. Right? And, I, and mm -hmm. I guess that's always a surprise to people, but there, there is efficiency. Effectively, we think there's about a third, on a pound per megawatt basis, we think that's about a third cheaper than you would get for a hundred two hour system for the size of system mm -hmm. we're getting. So from a capex perspective, it's cheaper, but it also brings other parties to the table. You know, for people who are lending to us or doing route to market agreements, mm -hmm. you know, Unfortunately, it's the same amount of effort for a small battery as it mm. is for a big battery. But, you know, you've obviously got a lot more revenue potential for a larger scale. So we think that there, there is economies of scale.